I don't, that's a, you know, I might faint, I might run down the street yelling. I, I don't know what I would do. I think that's, and that's the exciting thing is none of us know what we would do under that circumstance because it's, we're seeing like the impossible come to fruition before our eyes. So everyone would have a completely different reaction. And then to scale it out, like if that were to happen, how would we react as a group, you know? And then scale that out. How would we react as a city? You know, it, it just, the variables are, are just continue on. I, I don't know what I would do. Uh, the butterfly, butterfly, butterfly effect. Kurt, would you, yes? No. Just breathing. Just breathing on. So just take a breath, shall we? It's funny because you were talking about Langston and in terms of characters and when someone does move on, you also move on. So it's just, it's, it's, it's an obscure notion, isn't it? Right, it changes your life when people pass away that are close to you. And so while you may very well want to have them back in your life, people don't always think about the consequences of that. They don't necessarily reflect on what changes what happened to their life. You know, like one of the one of the characters in our show, the, the town uh, minister. He ten years ago was in love with a lovely young woman, and they had a very close relationship. And something happened to her. Now she comes back. Now in the meantime, he's married and uh, has a whole different life. And all of a sudden, the first love of his life comes back. So, <clears throat> awkward. Mm -hmm.